Hi, I'm Jordan. So I did RAM in 2012. Uh, that was the very first year that it started. I was going into my freshman year of college. So that was kind of intimidating for me just because um, I was the youngest one. And so it was, it was kind of intimidating. But um, one thing that I kind of noticed about RAM was that everybody Everybody decided to do it for a little bit different reason, whether it was just to dwell in God's presence or to learn more about evangelism and discipleship, which you will definitely learn um, if you decide to do RAM. But for me, it was kind of a little bit different reason just because I had lived in Cornell my whole entire life. And so when I heard about RAM, um, I was like, you know, God was going to do great work in Cordell and in my community. And so I wanted to see that. I wanted to be a part of that. So um, that was the main reason that um, I decided to do RAM. But um, just being exposed to all of the hurt and the brokenness and the sin that was going on in my community, I was not ready for that. I um, had lived in this bubble my entire life, and I had no idea that this was going on in my community, you know, this many, this many people hurting and in pain and broken. And, um, it really just opened up my eyes to my brokenness and to my sin and my pain and my guilt. Um, and so that was just a completely uh, different perspective for me. But, um, we were driving, so I remember one time we were driving, um, to, we were doing a VBS in Burnspot, which is like 10 minutes away from Cordell. Um, so we were on our way and uh, Jim uh, says, Jordan, do you really know how to get people to see God? So really just see him. And I was like, no, Jim, I have no idea. <laughs> and so um, he turns to me and he's like, you meet them where they're at. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. You know, I had no idea what that even meant. And so I really thought about it later and just really um, meditated on it. And uh, it just hit me one day that, um, you know, meet people where they're at, to love them and to fiercely love them. And, you know, it's not your job to change people. That's God's job. It's your job to love them and to show them Christ. And so um, that just completely changed uh, my perspective and the way I thought about things and the way I do things. And, um, you know, and RAM was a huge part of that. And so, you know, I saw the need in my community. I saw that um, uh, all of the hurt and all of the pain and all the struggle. And so, um, you know, I'm really passionate about uh, rural health now and um, rural medicine and that's you know what I'm pursuing and so Ram definitely had a hold of that and an influence in that decision and you know uh, I can't possibly think of anything else I would want to do and so you know Ram really helped that.